Teaching during a pandemic is no easy task. Now, doing it for the first time this year, even harder. But it makes me wonder why I want to dive in at all. I sat down with a first-year teacher who explains why the hardships are all so worth it. If you told 2019 Sarah Yokobitis what she'd be doing in 2021, she'd say you're crazy. My background is in social work. Now she says she'd be crazy to do anything but teach a group of kindergartners at Coppers Cove ISD. I've always been interested in helping the community and serving my community in one way or another. I didn't expect that it would land me in the elementary classroom, but here I am and I love it. I'm glad it did. She's a part of a brave and unique community. This year's batch of new teachers, they're really special. Facing the pandemic head on in the classroom for the first time. A place responsible for spreading COVID-19 and killing other educators in our area. I like to think not. I try not to think about it, but um, it is reality. I mean, it's, yeah, it's... It's a tough reality only a few are willing to take on. When they look back in five or six years, they're going to be, I mean, they, they will have done something that none of us have, have ever done. And a position that requires grit and will like no other. We're going to do this with innovation and a, with an unrelenting desire to, to help the kids in every way possible. All things that just start the long list of qualities Sarah Yokobitis encompasses. We can't really, we just can't give up on the kids. They deserve to have a quality education, no matter the circumstances of the world, the community. So we got to keep going. Now, while it was an emotional conversation for Yokobitis to have, she says teaching the upcoming generation is something she wouldn't trade for the world.